team have dominated this jumping season, Peter Scudamore and Martin Pike, and he went off at 5-4. to four. One of the best backs of the opposition was Southern Minstrel, written by Chris Rambo Grant, who spent most of the season out of action with a broken leg. It turned out to be a thrilling race. Sub under Loire, four from home, has a two to three length advantage, of Waterloo boy, Perota in third and Phoenix Girl, four, five, no harm done, six Southern Minstrel, and over that one, it was Sub under Loire, mistake by Phoenix Girl, has more or less jumped his way out of it there. Sub under Loire, by about two, from Waterloo boy, Southern Minstrel third, Perota four, no harm done, threatening there in five, long gap then, to Juvenile Light and Brookmount, and you can count the rest out of it as they race down now towards the third last. Saint the favourite for the Arco Challenge Trophy, being chased all the time, challenged all the time on the outside by Waterloo Boy. Faruda coming in with Southern Minstrel next, and then no harm done. Waterloo Boy is the challenger. Faruda very nearly went to that one. Waterloo Boy, a serious threat now to Saint Southern Minstrel moves into third, and no harm done for. This is the second last. Waterloo Boy. Lands just in the lead from Sabandouar, both under pressure, Southern Minstrel trying to get on turns, no harm done back and forth, Sabandouar has taken it up now as they race round the home turn, Sabandouar and Peter Scudamore from Waterloo Boy under pressure, Southern Minstrel, these three now as they come down towards the final fence in the Oracle, Waterloo Boy in the centre, Sabandouar on the far side, Southern Minstrel finishing strongly on the near side, Waterloo Boy lands in the lead, it's Waterloo Boy from Southern Minstrel, Waterloo Boy Sabandouar always pulls a bit out. Well, you can painfully see the signals going out from Peter Skew here. He picks his stick up, slap down the shoulder, try and keep the horse going, and he can feel what uh, we can probably see that he's going to be in a bit of trouble. A good job from Waterloo Boy there, with the colours of Mike Dealey. Mike actually bought this horse as a foal himself, you know. What a marvellous thing to go and buy a foal and then come and see him win at the National Hunt Festival. But as they started up the hill, here it looks like Chris Grant of Bernard Hathaway Southern Minstrel was going to get up. What some good jockeys these are. Heads down, going for the line, but it's Waterloo Boy, the 20 to 1 shot, who gets the spoils. Waterloo Boy, the winner at 20 to 1. Southern Minstrel second, 9 to 1. Southern Dubois third, the 5 to 4 favourite.